I'm Tamara McFarland and I'm a founding member of the Humble Vegetarian Society and we're here today having a vegan Thanksgiving potluck and doing a service project to benefit the Sequoia Humane Society. We're at humboldtveg.blogspot.com and we also have a Facebook page and a Yahoo group that people can join. Um, we have public gatherings every other month generally here at the community center and Sometimes on the off months we do smaller group gatherings at people's homes or restaurants. Our main focus is basically providing social support for vegans and vegetarians and doing outreach to show community members how good vegan food can be and why they might consider the benefits of eating a vegan diet. What are some of those benefits? Um, well, obviously it's better for animals. Um, the factory farming and animal agriculture industries are horribly cruel to animals as well as being extremely de detrimental to the environment and hard on the humans who work there as well. Um, there's environmental benefits to eating lower on the food chain and health benefits as well. And what are those? Health benefits? Um, well, there's no cholesterol in vegan food, so it can definitely help with you know, cholesterol issues, heart issues, diabetes. Um, kinds of, you know, sometimes people have good luck with weight loss, even, you know, switching to a vegetarian or vegan diet. And what are the environmental benefits? Um, well, the animal agriculture has been shown to have a greater impact on greenhouse gas emissions than even the transportation sector, which is kind of a seldom reported fact. Um, so basically, I mean, if you were to go from being an omnivore to eating a, veg a vegan diet, you're doing more to help the environment than if you give up your car. Anything else that you want the community to know? Um, just hopefully, you know, asking people to take whatever steps they feel that they can take. It's not an all or nothing proposition. Um, if you don't feel like veganism is necessarily doable for you at this stage, you know, try something. Like, don't, don't do nothing because you can't do the whole thing. So, um, you know, you can go meatless one day a week, or two days a week, or three days a week, and, you know, that's better than doing nothing, and if you find that you're enjoying that, you can always do more and um, start somewhere. Thank you.